Hi, it's Charles Cherney, and in the Ask Charles Cherney series, today's question is, what does it mean when a property is under agreement? So I'm a top real estate agent serving buyers and sellers since 1999 in Cambridge and Somerville, Massachusetts primarily. And the answer to this question is what it means when a property is under agreement is that there is a signed accepted offer binding the buyer and the seller in the transaction. It's a legally binding agreement, an offer signed uh, between buyer and seller. When that has happened, when the offer has been signed and the binder check has been delivered and the offer has been sent out to the buyer with the seller's signature, at that point, the property is under agreement. Now, there are different ways to speak of this. We can say that the property is pending. We can speak of it as being contingent. We can say it's under accepted offer. They all are the same thing. So here in this market that I work in under MLS PIN or Pinergy, the system will either indicate online that the listing is UAG for under agreement, or it will indicate that the offering is CTG or contingent. Now these mean the same thing. They mean that there is a signed accepted offer binding buyer and seller in the transaction. So of course the question is why are some properties UAG and others CTG in MLS? The reason is simply that the seller and the listing agent get to decide how to announce the accepted offer. So if there is a home inspection happening and potentially other contingencies that the listing agent and seller aren't entirely confident in being met, they may choose to list it as contingent in MLS, signaling the marketplace, we're working through some contingencies and pending the signing of the purchase and sale, for example, replacing the offer, the status will be CTG. So if a property is posted as UAG under agreement, it is typically sending a signal to the market that we feel quite confident that this property is spoken for. Again, this isn't to say that this is an offer without contingencies, there still may be a home inspection contingency in the offer. And it could just be the personal preference of the listing agent or the direction of the seller that has the status change in MLS to UAG versus CTG. What's interesting is once the status in MLS is under agreement, the days on market clock stops in MLS. If your status is contingent, the days on market clock continues until you arrive at the status of under accepted offer. So look, at the end of the day, for a potential buyer, when you encounter a property listed as contingent or under accepted offer, it means it's presently not available. It's spoken for. It's under a binding agreement with a buyer. So the only chance you're gonna to have to purchase that property is if it comes back on the market. Now, if a property marked CTG or contingent in MLS comes back on the market, the status in the system just reverts to active. However, if it's been posted in MLS as under agreement and it comes back on the market, then the listing history shows back on market. It's titled as such and it's recorded in the market history. So one of the advantages of posting a property in MLS as contingent initially is that if it does come back on the market, it just reverts to an active status and it doesn't show up as, if you will, a stain on the market history. It just shows up as active again. So uh, it's an interesting discussion that you can have if you're a seller with your listing agent and consider the pros and cons of posting as CTG and posting as under agreement. MLS has actually now made it a requirement after 14 days that listings that are marked contingent will automatically be moved into an under agreement status unless the listing agent uh, should choose to make known that the status is active. So that may be more information and detail on these statuses than you care to ponder. But going back to the question, what does it mean when a property is under agreement? It means that it's pending. It means that there is an accepted offer. It means it's under agreement. It means it's contingent. And these all mean the same thing. They mean that there is a buyer with an accepted offer. In Massachusetts, an offer is in writing and accompanied by consideration, which is typically a check. Although in COVID times, it can be a wire transfer via a service like DepositLink. 
It depends on the situation. But what's important to know is that offer acceptance to get to that status of under agreement, to get to that status of accepted offer pending contingent technically is offer is signed and delivered and consideration typically a check is received. So you wanna make sure if you're making an offer that your buyer's agent gets the signed offer back and that you've submitted your uh, binder check or first deposit so that you are completing the steps necessary to achieve the status of accepted offer. My name is Charles Cherney. I'm a top agent serving buyers and sellers in Cambridge and Somerville. Happy to connect with you by text, telephone, or email to discuss your search, answer your questions about offers, and otherwise be of service in helping you understand the market, your home, and the community. Be sure to subscribe to this channel. I'm making videos weekly that share with you information all about the market in Cambridge and Somerville. Take care.